E minor blues with the blue note. Now in jazz or in blues, uh, the blue note is a note that's used for expressive purposes, okay? And it's sung or played at a slightly different pitch. This scale that I'm playing, is, you know, is a pentatonic blues scale. It's a blues scale or a pentatonic scale using five different notes. But when you get, now, I'm starting on the sixth string, seventh fret. I'm using my first and fourth finger, seventh fret, 10th fret, one, four, exact same thing on the fifth string, seventh fret, 10th fret with your first and fourth fingers. Then when I get up to the fourth string, I'm playing the seventh, eighth, and ninth frets, a slight, tiny chromatic scale. All right. So this note right here, is an A sharp. That's your fourth note in the scale. Uh, even though this is, um, we're starting on a, this is a, it's like the same scale as this one. You can see one of my videos on how to play a blues scale. That's the pattern. That's on the 12th fret, sixth string, that's the E. But I'm playing the exact same blues pentatonic or E minor scale, right? That a blue scale and an E, but I'm starting on the B note. So the fourth is actually note is the A, and that's the blue note of any scale. That's what they call. It's a slightly different pitch. They call it the blue note, all right? So the A is right here. That A sharp, that's your blue note right there. E, F, G, A. So it's actually a slightly raised fourth note. All right, in order to play this scale, you know, once again, we're gonna start on the sixth string, uh, seventh fret, play one, four, seven, tenth, seventh and tenth frets with your first and fourth finger. Same thing on the fifth string. On the fourth string, you're gonna play one, two, three, seven, and eighth and ninth frets. There's that blue note. Okay. We're gonna move up to the G string and play the seventh and ninth frets with your first and third finger. Jump up a half step on the B string to the eighth fret and play eight, 10, 11. And then there's your blue note again. You hear how it sounds slightly different. Oh. You could actually do that. You could play the chromatic on the fourth and third strings you wanted to but so that there we go the eighth tenth and eleventh frets and then you're gonna finish up on the B string on the E string the first string on the B note which is the seventh fret and tenth fret so the sixth string and the first string obviously are the same Just a different perspective, a different way of playing an E blues scale. If you have any questions or comments, let me know. And please like and subscribe my channel and I can get some more stuff out to you. Have fun.